to Citizens to be Heard. Our first registered speaker is James O'Toole. Good evening, James O'Toole, 230 North Avenue. Come before council tonight to talk about 35 Maple and what is happening to the folks, to the folks over there, including my mother. Um, on August 9, 2011, Council held a meeting in the back chambers with the, former, with the former development commissioner, Mike Freemuth, and the new owner of the building, John Matto. Council was giving, was giving a list of things that Mr. Matto was going to do, everything else, you know, going to get an impact fee, $150,000, new rents, taxes, blah, 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 the whole rip. At this meeting, many residents of 35 Maple attended, and they were promised a, a number of things. Mr. Maddo stated, and this is on the city website, on the city website and has also been put on talk of the sound this afternoon, 52 tenants would see no, no change in their rent unless their, in, unless their income increased. 24 will be eligible for Section 8. 23 of the 24 would see less rents unless their, unless their uh, income increased. And none of them would see any money out of pocket. 32 residents were at market rate. Out of them, two would stay the same, 11 would have lower rents, 19, 19 would have more rent, 13 of the 19 would go up by $16, three of the 19 would go up by 30, 46, and $80. He also stated no one will pay more than 30% of their income no matter what. I could tell this council now for fact that that is a false statement. I came to council and told you what was happening to these tenants at 35 Maple, that they had to be recertified more than six or seven times. They had to fill out many papers and many pages of bank statements, et cetera, et cetera. They got letters telling them their rents would go up 200, 300. Well, after two years of this, my mom gets a note sent under her door telling her your rent is now $1,051 and from 886, a increase of $165. She got no warning. This is for the December 1st rent. And that's every tenant in the building got an increase. And those people are mad as hell. And they would have came up here tonight unless it was for the weather. And I'm telling you next month, unless you people meet with these residents, there's going to be hell to pay. My mother got a letter on September 1st saying that if she didn't get eligible for this uh, certification, not Section 8, which he said no more Section, it would only be Section 8, that her rent's going to a market rate of 1033. She gets another letter on September 27th when she was away in Scotland that if she doesn't show up for this meeting, they're raising her rent then. These are the letters. You could see it. This is unbelievable. Something has to be done. This council has to meet with these residents. I know Mr. Trangucci's been there, but everybody's got to get on board. That Maddo guy lied to those residents, and they got nothing for it. This is absurd, and I Sir, expect a phone call Mr. from Ocho, someone. I, I must ask you to wrap up, and perhaps you can circulate those letters to the council. Thank you. 